Hello. Okay, so um, for starters, I have to say that my decora is not like anybody else's decora because decora is very personalized. So this video is about what decora is and a small amount of how to, um, but not really kind of how to because that's a totally different video. Um, I'm just going to show you some examples of some things that are decora. Um, okay, so, uh, for starters, I have to explain to you, um, about the region of Harajuku and Harajuku Station. Okay, so this is a place in Japan where there's a lot of urban street styles. Things like visual key, fairy key, um, gothic lolita, sweet lolita, um, cosplay actually originated there. True cosplay. <laughs> uh, you know, anime characters, video game characters, that kind of stuff. Um, which cosplay is short for costume play. Um, so you get dressed up like an anime character. That actually started um, in Harajuku Station, you'd see. If you go to Harajuku Station in Japan, you'll see all sorts of crazy, awesome-looking people, and you'll see a lot of people that are dressed up, you know, in costume, you know, portraying a, a character. So um, one of the, the fashions that is there, that developed there, is called Decora. Decora, what you can get from it is that it's very decorated, um, kind of like um, you pull everything out of your hair clip drawer and your jewelry drawer and you throw it on. <laughs> it's a little more structured than that. I wouldn't actually suggest just throwing everything on, especially when you first start out. Um, yeah, and another thing to remember about Decora is that it's going to get people to look at you. I got so many looks yesterday in my tiny little rural county of Polk County, Oregon. Like, nobody here does what I do. So, <laughs> you know, you've got to not be afraid to stand out. Okay, Decora is something that both boys and girls can do. Um, boys usually wear longer pants with it and aren't into the sock thing so much, um, unless it's like knee-length shorts and then they wear socks with that. And, um, a good example of a decora boy would be Bao Minisuka from Anne Cafe. We miss you, Bao! Um, so, um, yeah, he was, he was very decora, so, well, sometimes he was very decora. Sometimes he was very Lolita. So, <laughs> uh, yeah. So, um, I'll show you some examples of, like, some things that are very decora. Okay, so, um, these little clips here. Not these ones so much. Um, but these little clippies here are very, very decora. Um, little bows like this bigger bows even, um, hair extensions. This is really cute, um, bow clip, bow hair extension, you know, like the, um, Lady Gaga kind of bow. That's actually become very popular in decor is hair bows like that. Um, also clip-in extensions that are very colorful, um, like my ice blue colored ones, or my pink one, or my orange one, or my yellow one, or my green one, or my, um, pink and black stripe one, or my paler pink ones, um, that a lot of you think that I got from Dollar Tree, but I actually got from Sally's Beauty Supply, so I'm going to correct you on that one. <laughs> I actually don't buy a lot of hair, uh, actually the only hair extension that I bought at Dollar Tree was this bow, so yeah, that's the first Dollar Tree, and I'll see if I like it, if I don't like it, I'm probably never going to use it again, that's kind of, like, I buy things to try them out, you know, and when it's only a buck, why not? Okay, so, um, oh, little clips like this, little claw clips, um, just stick them everywhere, everywhere, all over the pigtails, all over the 
tiny donies on the side and your fringe and everything. Everything. Stick them everywhere. Like the whole package. No, I'm kidding. Sometimes. <laughs> you always hear experience with it. Yeah, the whole package. But, you know, um... Moving on to makeup and nails. You can see my nails. They're very, very pale and pretty. I used these nail polishes. Um, so nails um, should be pale pastel colors. Um, if you're a girl, if you're a boy, um, you should paint your nails black. <laughs> yeah. Um, or you could do, like, something like this, if you're a guy, a non-girly color, um, so, uh, yeah, um, for clothing, you want really fun graphic tees that are brightly colored, my popsicle shirt, okay, um, a really important clothing item in Decora is socks. You want knee length socks that mismatch, or you want to layer socks. And they should all be in fun prints and patterns with lots of colors. For um, bottoms, girls always, almost always wear skirts or shorts. Now I'm wearing the only Decora shorts right now, and um, they're really, really short. Um, <laughs> my grandma doesn't like me wearing them out in public because they're really, really short. Um, and they're cut off actually from sweatpants that I bought. Um, tutus are very Decora. Um, layering tutus is even better, especially if they're different lengths. And, um, yeah, this is a skirt I was wearing yesterday. Just really foofy little skirts. Um, if you live in a place that's very cold, you should do colorful jeans like this. I have, um, pink and purple ones. Um, for sweatshirts, they should be printed and fun. Um, this is my, um, leopard print cardigan. Cardigans are really decora. Um, and uh, I skipped the rest of makeup. I only did nails. Okay, for makeup, your face makeup, lighter foundation. Just cover up the little blemishes with some concealer if you have any blemishes. If you have flawless skin, you don't even need anything except maybe some moisturizer. Um, for lips, um, pink color um, that's very light or, you know, colored lip glosses, um, my hard candy lip gloss, yay, colored lip glosses, like, like this, this works, this can double because it has a little loop as jewelry, so I'll go back into jewelry, um, in a minute, okay, for eyes, very thin eyeliner on top, maybe a little thicker than on bottom, but, you know, and then on bottom only do half of your lash line, and then the other half of your lash line in white and your waterline in white. And the waterline in white makes your eyes seem bigger. And for the mascara, concentrate on the outer lashes more than the inner lashes to get a doe-eye effect. You can also add false lashes to just the outer corner of your eyes to give even more of a doe-eye effect. It's very big eyes are very popular with um, Decora. So, um, back to jewelry. Jewelry is things like candy bracelets and big chunky charms, like this. Um, keychains, like, uh, Tochi Pets and, um, all stuff like that. You know, the keychains that you got in your cereal boxes when you were a kid, you know. Those kind of things are very decora. Um, and you just, like wear as much of it as possible. <laughs> as for hairstyle, pigtails, almost always. Um, sometimes you can curl it, but um, it's usually straight. It's usually kept straight. And for bangs, either slightly angled or blunt 
heavy bangs. Like my bangs. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's pretty much what the Cora is. Um, some places in the United States that I know you can find some really cute decor stuff. Actually, um, Walmart sometimes has some really cute um, and inexpensive, like for five bucks, colorful graphic tees. Um, they also have a bunch of Hello Kitty stuff, which is really good for decor. Um, Dollar Tree has like some of the best clips and socks that you can ever find. Um, they also sometimes have lip glosses like this that you can turn into a charm. Um, they also have a lot of good colored lip gloss. So, yeah. Peter's going to sleep. Not okay. Um, also, Hot Topic has a lot of good things, um, like t-shirts that would work, um, especially if they're anime characters, like the white t-shirt they have with Sebastian in the pink cow costume that is like that's all chibi it's so cute I wish they had it in my size but they don't yeah Hot Topic is a place I usually go for things like jewelry and hair clips and um extensions and stuff like that because they've got a bunch of really cool colorful clips and extensions and jewelry that's chunky and stuff like that Claire's also has good hair clips and um also, oh, some they have they have things like Converse style boots, like Ked boots and stuff like that. Those are always, 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 always good for decor. Um, Converse are great because you can get like two different colors and mix and match and mix and match with laces and stuff like that. Um, decor does a lot of very mix and match stuff. So um, your outfit should not look cohesive. As there's a tip for you. Your outfit should not be cohesive. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much what Decora is. Um, oh, and don't forget, thrift stores are your best friend when you're doing Decora, especially in the United States. There are also a bunch of shops online that carry Decora or Lolita stuff. That is more expensive stuff because it's made specifically for that fashion, um, which you don't exactly have to do, and um, I personally don't like shopping online because um, I, when I have to use my grandma's credit card, and it's like more expensive and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much, pretty much it. So, sayonara!